In this tutorial on Premium Pro, I will show you how to convert horizontal video to vertical by using auto reframe. So let's get started. In this sequence, I have got two videos. One, I have cut into two parts just as a demonstration. At the same time, I have applied a transition between the two videos and I have moved the position of one of the videos so that you could see the difference in the options that we're going to select. Now, if we go to the project panel and then right click on the sequence of your project, you should see an option called auto reframe sequence. Select that. So this will create a new sequence. You can change the name of the sequence if you want, but the most important thing is the aspect ratio. We're going to change it to vertical, which is 19 by 16. And here we got two options for clip nesting. The first one we're going to try is don't nest clips. And this will replace your current motion adjustments. And that's the reason why my video has got both a transition as well as motion adjustments. So click on create. And as soon as you do that, it will start analyzing your video and it will create a new sequence. Meanwhile, it will keep your transition intact and it would make your video into a vertical video. So now I press Ctrl Z to undo this and then I will try to do the same thing but select the second option. So go to your auto frame sequence. Again, change the aspect ratio to a vertical one but this time we will select nest clips. This will keep motion adjustments but remove transitions and then click on create as you can see this time our new sequence doesn't have the transition that our original sequence had so that's one of the major differences now if you select the clip and then go to the effect controls under the motion and if you look at the position you can see reframe has created a lot of new positions to follow the object at the same time you can see the option for auto reframe here again you can also change the motion preset to for example fast motion or slow motion and now I select slow motion and then it would automatically analyze you could also watch my other two videos one if you want to manually convert horizontal video to vertical video and the other how to make Instagram feed post size video and to support my channel please don't forget to subscribe